Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. As you know, I requested the IAEA Board of Governors should meet today to consider my report entitled Final Assessment on Past and Present Outstanding Issues Regarding Iran's Nuclear Program. This report is the result of the agency's best efforts to clarify issues with possible military dimensions, which I identified in 2011. While it was not possible for the agency to reconstruct all the details of activities conducted by Iran in the past, we were able to clarify enough elements to provide an assessment of the whole picture. My final assessment gives clear answers to two very important questions. Did Iran engage in activities relevant to the development of a nuclear explosive device? And if it did, it is still doing so. The main elements of my report are as follows. The agency assesses that a range of activities relevant to the development of nuclear explosive device were conducted in Iran prior to the end of 2003 as a coordinated effort, and some activities took place after 2009, 2003. The agency also assesses that these activities did not advance beyond, beyond feasibility and scientific studies, and the acquisition of certain relevant technical competences and capabilities. The agency has no credible indications of activities in Iran relevant to the development of nuclear explosive devices after 2009. Nor has the agency found any credible indications of the diversion of nuclear material in connection with the possible military dimensions to Iran's nuclear program. The board has adopted a resolution which provides guidance for the agency on the way ahead. Ladies and gentlemen, completion of my assessment is an important step forward, but much work remains to be done. The IAEA will continue to undertake verification work in Iran, but in future, Iran will implement the additional protocol to its safeguards agreement with the agency and we will have powerful extra verification tools at our pro disposal. This issue has a long and complex history, and, and the legacy of mistrust between Iran and the international community must be overcome. The agency will continue to address the Iran nuclear issue with the same professionalism it demonstrated in the past. <laughs>